Hello friends, today is a good day, but some eh, not so good news, but today is a good day because as judging by the title, you already know what this video is about. I am going to pick up my suppressor. It was approved by that three letter agency that is a bunch of BS, but that's just the world we live in right now because I can't do anything about it without that magical paper saying that I am allowed to own this item. We are going to get my suppressor. When I got the email the other day, this is what my face looked like. Not even kidding. That I was all by myself. When I saw that email, that's what my face looked like. Let's head to the shop, pick it up, and I'll show you what I got. Oh, I didn't see you there. This is fun. This is fun. Goes on super easy. Of course, there's no carbon lock, but it's finally home. Enough with the fun stuff. Uh, really, really excited that I got this suppressor. Um, I only have the end cap for the 30 cal, the 308 caliber. Um, I don't have the 5.56 or the 6.5 Creedmoor. The local shop did not have them when I went to pick up this. Uh, and it, if I ordered it, it wouldn't be here in time for the weekend. So I'm just gonna shoot some 300 blackout subs, some subsonic ammo, and then probably just shoot some 308 just for funsies. Um, the main, main reason why I got a suppressor was for home defense. Uh, it's gonna go on a 300 blackout with subs and that will be easy on the ears while providing enough ballistics to um, take down a target if if need be. Now, there was somebody in my neighborhood who said, you gun nuts just wanna use your guns. And let me tell you something, I do not ever wanna use my firearms in a self-defense situation, but I wanna be prepared if I had to. I do not wanna deal with the after effects, the legal ramifications, but, I also want to have what I think would be the best weapon for the job. So, nevertheless, bad news is that there is a new bill being introduced in Congress. It is H.R. 2985. I've been watching Armed Scholar a bunch lately because there has been a plethora of 2A news, um, both good and bad. This one's definitely bad, where they want to ban the purchase, sale, ownership, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, of suppressors and even though the government does not own this i did not buy this from the government they would issue a mandatory buyback and i don't know how they can buy something back that was never theirs in the first place uh, the arm scholar also said that he doesn't expect that to pass with the current congress but they only need one event and um opinions will sway. So that is definitely some bad news. They are definitely trying to chip away at our Second Amendment rights. Do not let up your guard. This isn't uh, 30, 40 years ago when, you know, these old timers would say, oh, they've been saying this for 30, 40 years. This is getting out of control these days. Um, they are really chipping away at our rights. But there is a little bit of good news. Um, <clears throat> my personal filing time, I have finished my paperwork on October 21st of last year, and I really was not expecting to get it this soon. I got the email on May 13th, a couple days ago, and that puts me at 204 days for a trust filing. So um, <clears throat> I asked the guy if the wait times were uh, coming down, and he said, no, it's typically, uh, you know, still staying at a year to um, 18 months. But when I asked Google, hey, how many months is 204 days and it said 6.7 months. So I got mine in less than seven months and that is pretty fantastic. Wait time, even though the whole whole process is absolute horse crap because if I wanna go in and buy a suppressor with my concealed carry, I should be able to. I shouldn't have to pay $200 to the government, but that is another story in and of itself. That's gonna do it for this one. Hope to get out to the, week, uh, the range this weekend, shoot some subs. I've been looking forward to this for a very, very long time. That's going to do it for this one. Like and subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section below. We'll see you in the next video.